Davey Mac, when's your first porn? When's your first Twitio porn? Since oh. you are such a porn connoisseur. Well, there's a pornographic film that exists in the McDonald household, but I will ne- not be posting that on the internet. What, what happens in this porn? As you call it. Um, there's Sucky, and then there's um, From Behind, and then uh, it turns around, and she took the camera, missionary. That's the low light of the film, because you get to see my scary face. And I was like, why did we shoot this? I was very upset as the director. I'm How like, long is the McDonald family porn? I'm like, I'm never giving you the camera again. It's a solid three minutes. What I would love to do... <laughs> Is the pay a ninja to break in there and steal? No, <laughs> no way. How I much? Will, how I'll much to it. buy the rights? <laughs> no, um, I've how much to buy the rights? If you gave me, honestly, you it have to be pretty five hundred thousand dollars. I'd do it for five hundred thousand dollars. I I I get it. If you guys can get that kind of money, I'll give you the porn right now. Five G's. Five hundred thousand. Five G's, and we won't release it. We just have one small party, and we all watch it and crack up. Are you for real? Five thousand dollars for, and you won't release it. No, but I can have a party and How everybody many watch invited? it. invited? Let's say a hundred, hundred fifty. <laughs> I want to. <laughs> How many? If you have just you, we your family, admission. why you, I, your why family. I want your family to come to this is beyond Kids? me. <laughs> <laughs> the you family were, film of the year. You remember, Dave? I, if we had a private party of twenty people, I I do that for five Gs. A private party here in the studio for five Gs, I would do that. And can there be a question and answer period after <laughs> with the director and the cast? There couldn't be with the director. I don't mm-hmm. think the cast would want to do it. All right, so for $5,000, yeah, uh, we can watch this. Yes. Private party in the studio, and I have to approve the guest list. That's absolutely Why? Pivotal. Who's on the guest list that can't come? Who would be on my guest list? I, I would fear... Um, I'd fear, I'd fear in an Earl Douglas because I would think he would, he would Twitter about it. He, he I know. Well, yes, he would the Twitters Twitter. are going to go out. It's going to be legendary. Well, he I'm would check in the in the party I too. Fear... I'm going to give you a couple of names. I want uh, Jim Norton there, obviously. <laughs> He's Sounds allowed. good. He's because allowed. I want this in his stand-up act. <laughs> He's allowed. Um, I would say OP and Anthony are definitely allowed. But again, they're not going to get the tape. Mm-hmm. Um, they're not going to record it. There's no audio. No. It's, and we it's, can watch it as many times as we want. It's a viewing. Yeah. Uh, if, no, it's okay. Yeah. But I mean. We can't wh- have a three minute party. All right. <laughs> you can watch it for as many times as you want in one hour. That's um, 20 viewings, if you do right. the math. <laughs> Let's see. That's, Jim? I, I wonder if I'll have enough of it by then. <laughs> All right. Jim? Opie, Opie? Anthony? Anthony. No. Scott? Mel? No, 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 Scott Mel, no. They're too... I want to end uh, whatever career uh, you have. <laughs> no, they're not allowed. Um, no, no, no E-Rock. While I love him... Why? I fear that the tape would somehow get recorded. So, and I love E-Rock, but well, I fear... Well, we'll do one of those things where we, you Check know, shake phones. people down. Yeah, <laughs> no, <all right. laughs> Please, yeah your cell phone has to go in the if back. We, I need mine. If Club Salt County acts as security, where yeah. he, he shakes people down, I will... All right, but he's not counting on the guest list. <laughs> and he can't get to watch. <laughs> That's fine with me. Even though he is my Blackberry buddy. All right. Keith the cop, I definitely no. want to show... Why not no. Keith? No. Keith! No, he's a little Nick Cage, bad lieutenant type. Uh, I you don't know. You just said you wanted security. I don't think... I think somehow the tape would get out if Keith Keith was here. I'm... And then I couldn't do all these I, film pirates that you think we know? <laughs> we have a lot of, you know... Illegal Keith, people. You know, Keith is always saying, hey, you want to come over for Avatar later? <laughs> he kicks bums in, in the subway, apparently. He's Hurt Locker. I can't trust the guy who just goes to random objects and kicks them. Yeah, right. we may need a double feature. So, um, I got O and A. Put my price up to ten thousand dollars. No, it's five G's. We already fucking have a deal. Five yep. G's from both of you. Fuck no. No, you said five G's. I'm renegotiating. Like LeBron, I'm going to renegotiate you my contract. You get five G's for this, and I will be passing a bucket around the audience, like uh, with the Will Rogers Institute before a film. <laughs> All right, I got Jimmy. All right, well then that's good. I guess O and A, Mr. Doug. Good. No, good that, call. no, my wife's hu- uh, father. I was going to say husband. <laughs> my wife's father <laughs> is not misses. coming. No, Mr. Doug. No, nope. she's good. What absolutely is the fuck? not. I can't invite anybody. I went to this no, party. Absolutely not. My mother is not allowed to. We're come to this. paying no. you for the rights to this movie I and have, the party. I negotiated in my contract. Did you have the checkbook with him? 
Write the check right now. I negotiate. I'll write the check. check. Yeah, but write I guess with approval. I, I put that in my contract. That's in one of the stipulations. I've guessed. I've filed cut. I'm the director. I'm Sam Raimi. All right, Mafia Life, Chris. Absolutely not. Yeah. Fred from Brooklyn. Go ahead, Fuck, call. No, no. I, I, Gone. If you want a Kathleen from the Bronx, she's hell allowed. Hell no. She's I'm allowed. I'm not putting her through that. Because I trust That's her. That's so mean. And I love Mafia Life, Chris. He's my silent partner, but absolutely not. That will that shit will show up in mob candy. Can't risk it. I don't want the denging. Mm-mm. No, I will. Uh, you know, someone like um, a Solera would be invited. <laughs> Solera's probably already seen it. <laughs> I don't think anyone has. Do you want like an Allison Bales here to review? <laughs> I wouldn't mind Allison Bales here for that. That's a good call. No, I am. I am not looking for uh, women at all. No I want women. this to okay. turn into an ugly stag party. <laughs> <laughs> a filthy, ugly, spilling beer, spitting, throwing okay. things at the screen stag party. All right, I got. All right, so men. Jimmy, Jimmy. Opie, Opie Anthony. Anthony, Keith yeah. the cop. Oh, I would prefer not Keith. No offense. It, there's a fence. I prefer it. Is Sam? Yes, he's allowed. Uh, then I don't want him. <laughs> he's invited. But what about Big A? Oh, I'm, I'm going to say yes to that. I'm, I'm kind of looking Big A That's going to shock you, but I'm going to say yes to Big A. Then I don't want him. <laughs> now, is Sam coming because he held the boom mic in this? Oh. <laughs> no. You guys are disgusting. This wasn't anything. No, he wasn't involved. Um, I haven't even seen it myself since we moved from Brooklyn to Jersey. This was a Brooklyn... Uh, right. Frenchie film. would like to come. Absolutely not. No. Then she then she can be on the Frenchie groping list or whatever that card was. Yeah. We don't need that. You never notice, no, there's, none of those people ever gave props to the big-ass card. They just invented their own cards. Yeah. Well, what are you going to do? Mm. It happens. I got my card. I keep my card on my serious identification. See that? So I have the my building pass... My serious pass, my big ass pass. You know, you're the most nostalgic out of all of us. You're very sentimental. Well, I, I believe that I'm loyal. You are loyal. And that's why this is going to be the greatest party ever. All right, I got Jimmy, Opie, Anthony, Keith the Cop, and Jonathan, my man. No, fuck no. No, my, that's my wife's ex We haven't seen him forever. No. He would be great. Fuck no. No, absolutely not. Uh, Ron, Georgia. Yeah. How's about uh, Patrice O'Neal? Got out, Patrice. Yes. Yep. Because I'm a big fan of his. He sh and we shook hands the other day in the hallway. It was a wonderful moment. <sighs> and I love Jim, of course. So he's allowed. Opie and Anthony are allowed. Oh, I just thought of something. I'm going to call Ant and see if we can't get a screening room. Okay. That's just too big. I thought we are going to put it in the DVD player and watch it in one of these screens in the studio. Wouldn't you like to just have it there and we can have an after party with the cast? And then start talking about rolling it out. The director will be there. The cast won't. I, mean, I can <laughs> he guarantee. He has the hot it. tub. Maybe there'll be a sequel. I want. I want ten thousand dollars though. Five. You five G. We gotta have a fucking deal here. How about seven, 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 seven thousand five hundred. Seven thousand five hundred. I get to invite anybody I fucking want from the outside world, no. and I get to have return fucking screenings. <laughs> no. Um, Bob, you're on a fez. Hey, gentlemen, I have a couple questions about the video. One, Dave, is there any good dialogue or uh, no. audio that we can throw out over the airwaves on this thing? And two, why don't you guys do it in studio and broadcast? There's, yeah. I'm not broadcasting it. If I, I said if you want broadcast it, I, I want $500,000. Yeah, it's not for broadcast. It's not for broadcast. It's going to be a disgusting, old-style smoker stag party. <laughs> uh... I'd yeah. like to watch it maybe at Anthony's house. What did I just fucking say? You said screening room, like that's uh, in his fucking his, home. Yes, oh. his screening room. I thought Jesus you meant. Christ. I thought you meant a public place. Yes, he he drives away from his home to watch a fucking movie. <laughs> Jesus, would once in your life would it fucking hurt you to watch his podcast, <laughs> to watch live from the compound? Uh, Vaughn, you're on a fuzz. Yeah, I was going to suggest Louis C.K. Maybe he'll finally get some respect. Here's the problem. Louis C.K. single-handedly destroyed Gap. 
He'd single-handedly <laughs> fucking tour that around. I'd invite him. You know, we're on the mend. I'm going to get somebody there from page six. Uh, go for Malloy. I'm like, not a big Rush oh, fan. You're going to go over to the Oh, Daily yeah, the news. news. That's the news. I forgot. I mean, if you had Cindy Adams there, that would be terrific. Bryce, you're on Ron and Fez. Yeah, I just wondered, like, if you're buying the rights, what are you going to name it? you got naming rights, right? Well, uh, right now, all we're calling it is push, push, come. Because it's, uh, it's only three minutes. There's, there's no come. There's no, there's, there's no, there's no money shot? Money shot. The boys are going to be upset about that. They're used to, you know, it was yeah. infrastructure. It was the these. first time we had, first and only time. It was very amateur. Mm -hmm. um, so there was no money shot. I don't even know. I think I stopped because I was like, I can't, don't film me. It ruined it. Is that caught on tape? <laughs> yes, that's caught you on screaming, tape. You screaming, stop this, stop like, the camera. Like Coco and Fame, <laughs> where you're trying to fucking cover your tits up. It's not supposed to be this way. It just ends. Uh, Steven, you're on my Hey, I was wondering if maybe uh, Lenny Kravitz could be invited. He, I mean, no. he, right. he's already been with that. Uh, no, that he hasn't. He, no, he hasn't. Thank you. You don't know what you're talking about. Thank you. <laughs> all right, all I have it. so far is Keith the cop, a couple guys that he works with. Um, how about somebody who knows film? Can I bring Franklin in for this? No. Is this a race thing? Yes. Also, does Franklin really know film? He he had like meatballs too on his favorite movies list. Franklin's got some taste for fucking shit. <laughs> but then again, so does Casey. So we can't fucking blame no. that. We can't blame personal taste. No, on she him. doesn't. She's I meant in taste. in relationships. Good taste. I right. I'm very tasty, as you'll see on this video. <laughs> Five, Ten thousand dollars. Perfect. Ask Dan if we can also get the post uh, party on live from the compound. <laughs> I'd love to do that. We got to get limos, tuxes, do the whole thing upright. Okay. Um, Hex, if you st sit next to me, don't put your hands in my popcorn. <laughs> and I just I want to say this is, of course, tentative <laughs> of, of approval from the missus. But I think if I s float 10000 or or, or $1,000. You know what? Now it's 4000 because okay, you keep 5, fucking oh. five thousand, five thousand. If I, th I'm sure that it'll get greenlit. All right. Um. What about Jay Moore? Yes. Yes, he's invited. Everybody should be invited. I want to no. do. No, everyone's not invited. Mm -mm. <laughs> they really should. This is a nice investment we're putting into this film. Well, all right. I'm excited. I'm going to call. I'm going to call and say, well, I'm going to talk, talk about the proposal during the break. Should be a lot of fun. <laughs> Should be a lot of fun. This is exciting. $5,000. I'm going to retire. I don't want you edited. I'm going to go on a cruise. No, there's no editing. I, I don't even have the capability to edit. I have to find it first, which I believe I, I should be able to do. Um, but I haven't seen it since we moved from Brooklyn to Jersey. So it's in a box somewhere. I'll find it. Are you uh, taking the answer with a dildo at any point in this? No, no I'm not. All right, that's going to cost. There oh. has to be a payoff for our $5,000. I am warning you, there is no money shy. It just ends. It's just a it's fucking Sopranos series finale. It's just gone. <laughs> so don't like to be it. It ends with the it. words, I think I'm pregnant. We got to fucking uh, grab some journey for the fucking when the screen goes to black. I have to have some post-production work done on this. <laughs> All right. Uh, we um, Let's go over here to Joe. Joe in New Jersey. You're on my fist. Hey, Ronnie B., I got a good title for the movie. Oh. Big Jew Tits. All right. That's not right. Don't say uh, Paul, you're on my fist. Hey, Ronnie, how about uh, the dude from uh, Blink-182? I don't even know who that is. What are you talking about? What is the dude? She's not... She listens to the show, people. I'll pull the plug on it. Any more silliness <laughs> like that. I'll fucking be Sony. You won't get your 5000 that you are so focused on right now. How much you bet we beat up fucking Dave and just take the fucking tape <laughs> at the end of the night? No, see, that's now, you know. Media that, be walking through Chinatown. That worries me. She sees a fucking movie called Redheaded Misgivings. 
that that's that's why I'm worried. I want to oh, stand by. I saw thing. something on like regular TV the other night, but like that softcore porn that they play on Cinemax. Yeah, calls the devil wears nada, and I'm like, <laughs> that's a pretty good fucking title. I never get sick of the titles. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> I love those shows, coeds. Uh, we're gonna break here. Eight six six Ron zero Fez. Eight six six Ron zero Fez. Plenty of stuff to talk about coming up, of course. We'll talk about Rick Pitino. Uh, also, Domino's Pizza, just the opposite of the jackpot. That was Pizza Hut. That was Pizza Hut. was jackpot. And, of course, uh, we will also be putting together the guest list. Uh, I've already heard from Ant. Yeah. Uh, and a couple other people. Big Kev, is it possible for Big Kev to be in? No. No, it's not possible. Now, Ronnie, I'm wondering about this project of, you know, where we have a screening party for Eastside Dave's home porn. Yeah. Um, I came in the studio and saw Dave on the phone, yeah. and he was being screamed at over the phone like Wilma Flintstone screaming at Fred. He's holding the yeah. phone, and I just hear this voice screaming so loud at him through the receiver. Right. Well, yeah. Trouble with the screening? Um, I don't think the screen's a possibility at this point. What happened? It's sort of on a Apocalypse Now territory <laughs> where, it, um, well, what happened was I didn't... Did you find out you were going to Frantic City? <laughs> I didn't consult her at all. Uh -huh. uh, I didn't talk to her about it. Uh, the price was probably a little low on my part. So more money is what it takes? No, there's going to be, I don't think, any amount of money at this point. But listen, I'm, I'm not putting this project up. <laughs> On the shelf, I still think we can do something. Did here. you really get in trouble? Oh yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> it's also my timing is never good. Right. Um, child just came home from the hospital. He threw up again last night. Now the daughter is throwing up today. So my timing wasn't great with this. You, so you just brought another fucking thing. I could have picked a time where the waters were a little calmer in the McDonald household mm -hmm. rather than babies throwing up like they're in The Exorcist and a wife who's sick. Yeah, it's like the time you and Barney <laughs> bought the hamburger joint without telling your wife. So, I apologize it's to It's like her. the time you and Barney <laughs> bought the hamburger joint. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Ron and Jan Show, 866-RON-ZERO-FEZ. 866-RON-ZERO-FEZ. I have the feeling that once we would have got out there for that party anyway, um, Anthony would be in his beautiful home, but he would have been upstairs. You would just saw a window on. He wouldn't have came down with us. <laughs> it's very Hamptons. <laughs> come on, Dave, what book? Uh, the, um, Doesn't come to his own parties. Great Hampton. Gatsby. Thank you. There you go. It took me a while. But but I, great I, Gatsby knew I knew it. I just couldn't. I was thinking sport because he well, says what was sport the, a lot. What was the what was the thing that kind of bummed her out about it? Oh, that I would sell in an intimate moment of okay. us two, like I'm, a scumbag. You know what? Now I'm starting to see. <laughs> so that's not going to happen. And I, I'll apologize on the air as well, but I apologized in private uh -huh. on the telephone there. So if you had it all to do over again, you'd made the call. I would have consulted first. I would have said, "Listen, we're going to get a nice hefty amount of money." To show a film of ours. And you definitely would have done, did it, huh? I would have done it, yeah. But, you know, uh, your wonderful bride sees all these people, parties, think of talks that. to the people, and now they would see her, yeah. like you said, in an intimate moment. There's a lot of things I don't think about. Um, and that's part of my problems in life. I don't really think very well. Um, and that was one of the things that I didn't think about. Yeah, of course. How could she go shake hands with Mr. Jim Norton again, you know, after this? Life after the party. It would be difficult. Um, now, at the same time, maybe I could get Franklin. Maybe I could edit it and just make the Davy Mac uh, movie. Let me tell you something. I don't know what we're going to do for the great Anspe party. We <laughs> have to... How about this? I got something else. Yeah. All right. And this I'm willing to come down on. Yeah. I'm willing to go about 4Gs for this. I'll Twitio uh, me jerking off. No. No interest. <laughs> no fucking interest. None. Zero. Why not? I came down the price. It's only uh, going to cost you four. No. Nobody wants to What about three? Mm -mm. Two. I don't even think you could pay us for that. <laughs>
It'd be good. I'll 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 lay it well. All right, eight six six Ron Zero Fez. Eight six six Ron Zero Fez.